we need to inform the community you may be contributing to the death of another human being unwittingly. A strong statement today from Manchester Police Chief Nick Willard asking people not to give money to panhandlers, a request that sounds harsh but is rooted in hopes of fighting the drug crisis. Many of these folks are going to use that money, they're going to purchase drugs, and that drug could kill them. The numbers back authorities' concerns. Manchester police say between 2015 and June 1st of this year, 24 people involved in panhandling have overdosed and six of them died. Now police want people to start helping in a different way. Use the money that you would otherwise give to them um, to a social service that would actually deal with the social condition that prompts the panhandler to be standing on the street corner. The American Civil Liberties Union of New Hampshire responding tonight, saying in part, as the city considers alternative approaches to addressing panhandling, the ACLU is willing to be a resource to ensure that free speech is protected. The ACLU does a fantastic job protecting civil liberties uh, of American citizens every day. Um, and they do that to a degree here in Manchester. Um, so I respect, I respect that. And I, but I do hope that they understand my perspective on this. Manchester police telling me that when they receive a complaint about a panhandle, they check them out to make sure they're not doing anything criminal. And if they are not doing anything criminal, they simply give them information about where they can get help. Live in Manchester, I'm Jessica Moran, WMUR News.